Howdy, howdy, everybody. Welcome to the Locating Texas channel. If this is your first time here, let us welcome you to the great state of Texas. My name is Derek. And my name is Amy. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon so you can get notifications every week when we post new videos. And if you're moving to the great state of Texas, make sure to visit our website, fill out the survey, so we can help you and your family make a smooth move to Texas. Howdy, howdy, guys. So my name is Eric Reagan. We are here at another modern mansion in Dallas, Texas. As you can see behind me, this home is absolutely beautiful. But I can talk about it all day. Let's go ahead and hop in. Welcome inside. My name is Amy with Locating Texas and I'm super excited to show you this amazing kitchen. So to my heart, I love the kitchen and I especially love this one because of the dual countertops here. You've got two kitchen islands, not just one, which means you have a perfect space for being both the chef, if that's what you prefer, or just entertaining. Um, my favorite thing about it is that you can cook over here. You've got this beautiful gas range oven, which is amazing. I think every luxury home needs gas because it cooks better. Um, but then you can have the kids at the um, breakfast over here on the kitchen island here while you prepare the food over there so you're not mixing up anything um, right into the kitchen space. But what I love so much also about this amazing home is how much cabinet space there is. So you've got the appliances that are right built in so there's not a whole lot of stuff that you need on the countertops. If you don't like clutter, like I don't really like clutter, then you will love that everything can be hidden in drawers and cabinets and both islands actually have a lot of cabinet space so you can stick anything you want inside of there it's pretty awesome beautiful stainless steel appliances a big walk-in pantry to house anything that you want but what's next is a beautiful master bedroom so let's go check that out and see Derek right in the other room Here in the primary bedroom, again, very typical to Texas, it's going to be on the first floor. Now this master bedroom is going to be perfect size for a large bed, for some good artwork on, this, on the walls. As you can see, these large windows are going to continue to let tons of natural light. And you can't fake natural light. So it's great to see this here. Again, the modern fan pieces to the light wood floors, absolutely beautiful. Let's go ahead and check out this magnificent bathroom to see if we have any surprises in store. Surprise, welcome to the master bath. This is one of my favorite rooms here in the whole house. And there's a few reasons why. So first, these amazing countertops, very similar to what you saw in the kitchen, the quartz countertops, the European style cabinetry, a big giant mirror with lots of natural light. Natural light's important in a bathroom, so that's always great. But come follow me into this shower. Oh, they did not miss any details here. You can see there's both a rainfall shower head as well as the shower head right here. So you've got two styles here as well as the luxurious tub. And what I love about this wall and the, all the material that's on this wall is that it looks like natural modern. So you can really make this into an oasis a very pristine like spa like experience so imagine with me for a second you've got like a bamboo table you've got some greenery maybe some candles uh, it can go transition right from that spa experience to maybe a little romantic bathtub experience the bathtub looks like it's big enough for two people so follow me we're gonna come right into this beautiful walk-in closet oh, I love the closet it isn't staged so you can see there's lots of space for shoes purses, hanging clothes, but you could even set up a nice little station here with some jewelry, maybe a poof seating so you can sit and put your shoes on. There's so much space in here. You could do lots of activities probably too. <laughs> All right, let's go check out what Derek has just run off to on the other side of the house. Let's go. So we're here in my favorite room of the house and for many reasons, as you can see behind me, 
is all about the TV side, right? Sunday football games, Monday night football, great entertainment space. Now the builder did a great job at building this dominant wall. As you see, it's really tiled out all the way up about 25 feet, which really kind of keeps your eyes floating over here to some of the modern light fixtures that they have. You see some of the HVAC uh, inserts. Now this is more of the modern feel, right? So very California style, high ceilings, very white neutral feels. You see the electric fireplace here with the LED lighting underneath, really just gives it some dimension and depth, whether you want to put some storage down there, you know, so some toys for your kids or whatever you may uh, want to put down there. It really just, again, accents this entire room. Being such a great space for entertainment, it very easily transitions into the kitchen. So again, you can talk, entertain, but really bring everybody together here where all the, of the bread is broken. Now, this is where you know, conversations are had, deals are made, where families really get to bond and come closer together. Now, it's all about the details for me, from the modern fans to the modern light fixtures to these open modern sliding doors that give you that inside, outside feel. This home has it all. Being built in 2022, it has more of the modern features, but these large living entertainment sliding doors really bring it all together for that homey feel. So Amy, I know before we even walked in the home, you were pointing out a couple things on the exterior, but also the interior. Yeah. Tell us about your favorite part. Yeah, so what I loved when I first walked up to the house was that you could see from the exterior inside through this big, wonderful window right here is this floating staircase. Whoa. It is so cool, it goes up to the second floor. It has um, the stainless steel beams as well as the um, staircase, which is oak, white oak hardwood floors all the way up. It's so beautiful and the whole exterior of the house has that natural wood with also that modern mixed feel, which I really find to be one of the coolest things about houses here in Dallas these days because they are architectured a lot like the LA style, Beverly Hills. I just saw another house that was selling that was very similar to this architecture, which I really like. And I know we have a lot of Californians that call us, so Definitely. they might like this too. Definitely. So your little piece of California here in the heart of Dallas, Texas, very modern, contemporary, but still a lot of that Southern hospitality that makes the Texas such a great place to live. Let's go ahead and check out the upstairs. Love the big, beautiful windows, lots of open space and natural lights. So again, the modern fan fixtures to the can lights that accent every room in the house. Going into the bathroom, you can see some of the different tile Floors, again, that consistent feel. Yep, same luxury style bathroom. So you've even got the amazing walk-in shower with the rainfall water sh waterfall. Look at the size of that tub though. Now that's a Texas size tub if you ask me. Let's walk over and see the other bedroom. So you can use this as another master bed. Um, it's got its own bathroom like we just saw. But if we come here across the hallway, you've got a nice room here that's perfect for an office. So smaller space. No, no closet, great fan, great light fixture, lots of natural light again. Let's walk over and see the rest of the house over here. Big open space up here, which I love. You would think that with the downstairs and the 25 foot ceilings that you wouldn't have a ton of space, but you do. Derek, you wanna show them in this room? Yeah, so another great guest bedroom, guest bedroom here, as you can see, again, very large size in this home. Now, with the master being downstairs with a half bath and full bath, Upstairs, you're gonna have three bedrooms and an office. Again, this large walk-in closet. Look how big this is, and this is for your guests. So plenty of storage space for all your shoes, purses, different outfits and suits. This is pretty consistent with the house. Again, more of that lighter 2022 feel, some of the grays, the whites, the light oak, white oaks. But Amy, you wanna show us the, the Jack and Jill? So this is a Jack and Jill bathroom, which is kind of cool. So you've got the dual sinks, one bathroom, if you have kids, this is a great room kind of extension that you'll see here. Same with the awesome natural lighting in here. But let's flip around and if you close one door and go out the other, you hit the other bedroom. When one door closes, another door opens. There you go. <laughs> We're here in the third guest bedroom. Again, very large, uh, separate bedrooms, again, for whether you want to put these kids' rooms, just another in-law suite up here. These could certainly act as secondary masters, especially the one that had its own individual bath. But 
I mean, one of my favorite parts, and honestly, the part that I love the most about this house is really this combining patio right here. So we couldn't get out of here before showing you this amazing private patio that you have back here. Amy? Yeah, so this is a great entertaining area. Right behind you, you can see there's a amazing sink outside, an entryway right into a small bathroom, half bath. So if you have guests over, you're entertaining on this awesome patio and this amazing little backyard spot, then you can just have them go right in without having to trek through the house, which I love. Definitely. So your backyard oasis, whether you want to put a fire pit out here or leave it open for some entertaining, you, this is really going to continue to pull together what we've seen consistent throughout the house. The white, more modern feels with that earthy tone of having the wood above, more of the modern light fixtures and fan fixtures out here as well. So great for entertaining, just moments away from some of the best shopping and entertainment in Dallas has to offer. That's right, yeah, the neighborhood is an amazing place and we couldn't leave without mentioning how awesome this neighborhood is. So you're very close to Highland Park, one of the coolest places in Dallas, Texas. You might have heard about it. There is a lot of people that are really trying to move to Highland Park because it is such an amazing spot. Um, really one of the oldest and the most historic places, I think, in Dallas, um, but has beautiful large homes and large estates just like this one. But what makes this awesome is that you aren't quite in Highland Park, you're on the outskirts of it, which makes it kind of like a steal because it's in an up and coming area. Well, it's a hidden gem, right? Being on just the outer perimeters of Highland Park and Bluff View Estates, this is what really makes up Dallas proper. So being just on the outside growth of that, you're seeing a lot of the homes in the community being torn down and rebuilt to be these modern day mansions. So this is why it's such a steal because the area is developing, but you're close in commute to everything you need to be. Educational systems from here or private schools are everywhere in North Texas. So whether you go to the public schools or private schools or more of your uh, agenda for your family, you can certainly find what you're looking for here. Yeah, and right here in Dallas, there are some great private schools. But I think that's it for our tour today. Thank you so much for sticking with us throughout the whole tour. This is an amazing home. Just mentioned again, Derek, tell us where is it and how much is it and what is the square footage? Give so, us all the facts. Ladies and gentlemen, that wraps it up. 3,200 square feet of modern luxury design, four beds, three and a half luxury bathrooms. This home has it all. We're located just on the outskirts of Highland Park here in Dallas, Texas at 4811 Cohen Avenue. If y'all have any questions about this property or any other modern luxury mansions in the Dallas Fort Worth, make sure to reach out to us via our Locating Texas website and schedule a call. It was great seeing you. Thank you. Until next time, ladies and gentlemen, let's boot scoop boogie.